Hey, what's going on, guys? RS Games here, back with an, a new game here. Today we are playing Gold Rush, the game. Ah, uh, I can tell you guys this much: I have not played this game in ages, and uh, I did get a comment. Oh, it's lagging a little bit. We just got loaded in the map, so I do apologize about that. But I did receive a comment from one of you guys saying that I should check this game out. We were uh, gonna start playing Auto Or a little bit. Uh, we may go back to Auto Or eventually but I got some work to do before we actually probably play that game so for today we're gonna start our roots here in Alaska um, I don't remember the name of this town we'll find out here in just one second uh, sorry about the leg the FPS is actually pretty good um, this game looks quite a bit different since the last time I played it um, oh we want to shut that off Um, how do I do that? Well, we'll just do that that way. Okay. We're going to run up to the bank. Um, I, I knew all this name of this town. Um, for whatever reason. Oh, yeah, it's Haynes, Alaska. All right. So, we want to lease the old. Oh, we can lease them all for a dollar? What? Um... All right, uh, so I must have everything's a dollar here. We got to fix that real quick. Give me one second. I'll fix that, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I now have it fixed, so we are going to lease the old Arnold parcel um, for zero dollars. Um, We're probably going to have to take out a loan, too. Uh, let's see. How much money can I get? Um, Balance? No. Um, we're not gonna take out a loan yet. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm gonna turn on everything's a dollar for just a little bit. I'm gonna buy the. Ah, uh, no, we're not going to. We're not gonna do it that way. We're gonna do it legit. We're gonna try to make our real living here. So bear with me, guys. This is a new series. We're trying to get our get get set up how we're gonna do it. I'm gonna change my mind about a thousand times, but we are gonna do it the legit way. We're gonna go out and dig by hand for a little bit and hopefully we get a, uh, a gold nugget right that's our hope all right so it's been a while since I've had to do this so we want the the pump right that's a uh, ooh, that's a lot of money okay um now we want both sluice boxes right hopefully we can afford all this how much is that pump Small diesel pump is 160 bucks. All right, we may not be able to afford all this. Not gonna lie. Um, total cost is 420 bucks. Let's see, how much money do we have? We have 450. All right. Um, them are not cheap. We want four of them. So we're gonna have to do it the no pump way. Actually, we're just not gonna get the extension. Oh, that's not gonna help us. Um. All right, we're not gonna get the pump one. We're gonna get the the no pump one. It's gonna take a lot more work, but that's okay. Um. So I got the sluice boxes. I got some mats. Uh, we're gonna need some pails. We'll get uh six pails. Um, what else do we need? I think that's all we need for right now. Trying to think. It's been, like I said, it's been a long time since I've played this game. Um, so I'm trying to figure out what I'm all gonna need. We don't need that wave table, but that would be really nice. But we don't we can't afford that wave table. So we're gonna buy what we got. Okay, don't show this again. I got some of the tutorials showing. Alright, so we're gonna load all our stuff up. We're gonna go try to see if we can get some nuggets here today. Um because we're gonna need to make some money. All right, we're just going to throw... Oh, I bought that pump. I didn't need that pump. Shoot. Um, I don't think there's a way to sell it either. All right, we're just going to take some of the stuff then. We're going to need the mats. Oh, the mats. Um, I can place them in there for quick storage, right? All right, I'm going to take... I'm going to take all the mats because we can run two loads fairly easy all right so this first episode is gonna be a little bit boring guys I do apologize 
But once we get up and running, we'll be making some big money, get some of the big iron in, and really cranking out the gold. All right, I want at least, I might as well bring all the pails. So I'm going to need to throw water in this thing. That's not going to be any fun at all. But uh, we're going to have to do it that way. Because we're going to be broke. I could leave everything is on on this dollar. And then we could have a heck of a mine starting out. But that's not how we're going to do it. Alright, now that we got everything bought. I'm going to drive over to our mine site. And I will meet you guys there. Alright guys, we uh, started digging. I filled up the hopper. So I was going to just show you guys kind of, you dig dirt, you can either throw it in the bucket or fill it right in the hopper here. Then you take your bucket and you should be able to pour the water in and it starts running the gold for you. I don't know how much water it actually takes for a bucket or for each run. All right, it looks like it's already starting to dry up a little bit. So we're going to have to do this a few times. Now in my digging that I did do, we uh, did find a nugget. It was a 0.78 ounce nugget. So we're already off to a fantastic start, really. All right. So I'm just going to keep doing this away. We're going to do a little time lapse here. We'll uh, see what we find. There's obviously some gold getting in the mats. Now we are losing some because we don't have the extended sluice box. But that's just what it's going to be. So I will meet you guys kind of right after this time lapse here. We're going to try to get these mats completely to 100%. And then we'll see what gold we got. Alrighty guys, well, we pretty much filled them up to 99%. We're not going to push our luck because we don't want to lose any. So in that digging, we found 8.654 ounces worth of nuggets. So that is really good for us. That's a good start. We got a 10 ounce goal. Okay, that one's clean already. These ones just are one dip. Okay. Easy enough. Alright. So hopefully we can find about another ounce and a half in this pail and then we're gonna be able to sell that and then hopefully we can get ourselves set up for the next episode today was just kind of getting our roots going which is all i really needed to do all right we're gonna throw that there so we got our uh, little marbles worth of, of gold 
Oh shoot, I need to fill that that uh, big tub up with water. Also, that is something you need to do. All right, we'll run this back up. Well, actually, maybe I'm hoping if 10 ounces, we can make uh, enough to get a little mobile wash plant going. And also lease a uh, excavator. All right. I'm not too good at panning gold here, so we're going to see if we can. Oh, I see some gold. I see some gold, but they're not real good chunks. All right. Let's see if we can wash this off some more. There's not a lot of gold in there. Hopefully, if we wash it again, we can maybe find some more. Hopefully. Does not appear, so I think that's all we're going to get today. Which, uh, well, I don't think that's going to get us to our goal. We'll see. i got to figure out how to go into the picking mode. Shift. All right. Wait, let's bring this up a little bit more. Um... Uh, and bring it closer to me. There we go. All right. Uh, now it's not letting me go in the gold picking mode. Oh, there we go. All right. So we're going to pick this up. Hopefully it's going to add up. Not, not well enough. <laughs> Shoot. All right. Well, we're going to have to keep digging, I guess. Yeah, that was not 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 very good. The nuggets are definitely where it's at. I couldn't imagine uh, trying to get enough gold out of these to make it worth your time. All right. Um, how do I get out of this mode entirely? There we go. All right, we're gonna throw our pan back. We'll take our pail back out there. Now there is a little bit of cheating way. I think if you just throw the go the dirt in the hopper, you find the gold. Um, I don't really want to do that method. But we might have to. Alright, we're just going to see if we can find a few more nuggets here. Because we want to hit 10 ounces. To hopefully make enough to purchase that mobile wash plant. Or at least an automatic one of these. 10 ounces should be roughly $20,000 though, I think. I could be wrong on that. I don't know what gold prices are here right now. No nugget yet? Really? Oh, that was a bad run for us. We didn't find any nuggets that run. Eakers. Oh, I keep dropping this pail. All right, let's fill this thing up. Get this run through. I hope you guys enjoy that little bit of time lapse there. Um, we'll, I, I won't know how it'll be until the final final edit, I should say. But I, I've been working on trying to do some of those in some of these episodes that get kind of boring. I'm just hoping we can make enough today to get that mobile wash plant so next time that we come back, we uh, can start actually processing some gold the real way. Because this is not the most effective way. It's actually the worst way. But uh, you can find the nuggets like that. Ooh, that was a good one. Yep, uh, let's see if we can get one more. We're going to have a little bit of gold wash, or gold loss. But anyways, we're going to take that 10 ounces, run to the blacksmith, try to get ourselves a gold bar out of the deal, and sell our gold bar. And hopefully become the king of the Klondike. Now, technically, if you keep doing this, I think you can get a nugget. So we're just going to try that. I want to see if I can get like another half ounce one or something. I think you can do it like that. I hope. We're going to try it. Anyways. Uh, we'll try like five more shovels. There we go. We got another nugget. Okay. So we got 11 ounces. Obviously the gold loss isn't that much because we ran a full mat's worth there. And we only got like a tenth of an ounce. All right. Well, I'm going to run to the goldsmith, get that gold bar going, and I'll meet you guys after that once we sell it so we can start looking into our future purchases. Alrighty guys, well just like that we uh, got our gold smelted down and we're going to sell this uh, like 9 ounce bar. I already had to sell one. It's worth $10,000. Okay. Oh, gold price is not what I thought it was. Oof da. Ooh, yeah, it's way down right now. We want it. Well, it's not super far down, but I wish it was the 2,000 ounce mark. Or $2,000 an ounce. Alright, well... 
It could be worse, but we're going to take it. We're going to go to the, the general store and see what we can do. Hopefully we can purchase that uh, wash plant. We already do it technically have one water pump that I mistakenly bought. So hopefully we maybe only have to buy one more. Obviously a large water pump would be nice, but uh, that's not going to happen. All right, we're going to put that handbrake on and see what we can buy. How much is this thing? Oh, it's only that's actually only not bad. $4625. All right, give me one of those, please. All right, so we got that. Um we need a mobile generator. It's 20% off. Perfect. All right, we're going to be spending all of our money here. Um we're going to get one more water pump because I think I'm going to need probably two. That would actually be the way to go, but that's not going to happen. We do technically need this, I think, for the most efficient mining. But uh, for now, we're not going to be able to. Uh, let's see. What kind of hookups are on this thing? All right. I think they're small hoses. So we want a couple of these. Probably three. We need a filter, wherever that may be. Filter, filter. It's probably back here now that they got the parts area. Um, Let's see. Where would a filter be if I was a filter? Right here. Yep, water filter. We want one of them. Perfect. Probably a few small, small garden hoses. At least one. All right, we got that one. Uh, we're going to need a power cable. What kind of power does this take? I think it's a blue connector. Let's run out here. Oh, I haven't purchased the plant yet. We're going to purchase that real quick. All right. So we've already spent five grand of what we made. We still got $5,000 left, so we're not sitting too bad. Okay, it's a blue plug. And I believe the small green hose hooks into it. I'm, I'm like almost positive that. We should have enough pails. So we're going to buy ourselves a few small green hoses because I do believe those can go on that small water pump. I was going to buy two of those just in case we got it set. Um, How much is that splitter? We're going to get a splitter too. Right. Um, This wave table. We really want this wave table. All right. I think that's all we really need for that wash plant setup. $3,500. All right. That's bought. So I'm going to take care of loading all this stuff up at a later date. We're going to go see if we can get ourselves an excavator. I will have this all set up for you guys the next time we record in this game. Which I'm going to probably plan on doing next Friday. I'm going to kind of take a break from flashing lights for a little while. We'll see how it goes. Alright, let's see if we can get our hands on one of the small excavators. I'm also going to need a few fuel cans too. That's a good note to think about. Uh, how much is the rent cost? Five hundred and four dollars daily. Oh, it's only twelve grand. We're gonna have to rent it for now, and uh, we're gonna get that delivered to our site, and that'll be perfect. All right, we're gonna order that guy for. Uh, we don't need that. How much is it gonna cost to transport? Actually, we can just send these right there. Perfect. Three grand. Do I have that? I don't. All right, I can afford. I can. I can just haul my mobile plant over there. That that's no problem. All right, guys, that's gonna be the end of today's episode. One quick thing: you guys are absolutely awesome. You've been absolutely hitting that subscribe button like crazy here lately. I really do appreciate it. Just the other day, we were at like 320, and now we are way up there, like the 370 mark. So you guys are awesome. But if you have not done so already and you want to see more content on this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that like button down below. We're in that push for 500 subscribers by the end of the year. And you guys, with your support, we are well on track. So I do appreciate it. But with that, guys, I will catch you next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye.